A question on Bootstrap Studio that I got was, uh, can I make a nav bar transparent? Uh, well, like everything uh, you can make transparent. So here we go again, open the, uh, where it says the search in the studio uh, is, I'm um, put nav bar. So there we go, here it is. And we just drag this into the, into the uh, page here. So here we go, that's the, that's the nav bar. So in order to really see if this is working, we just put body, element style on there. And we'll put background color and we'll use red. So that shows up very easy. Okay. So there, as you see there, um, there's no transparency at all. It's just the white um, um, default color. So what we do there is we just go there, we we'll click that, and so we have this uh, here. I'll just show you by zooming in. So you have your nav class and your nav bar. And now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put where it says element dot style. We're just going to put opacity. So opacity. This sometimes never used to work on one or two browsers, but I think all the modern ones it does. And all we're doing there is going to put not point say seven. Okay. So now you can see the red coming through that uh, through the color there. And what it, where it is is that if you have uh, the higher the number is the less transparency so if we, if we put and say something there that's uh, should we say 0 0.3 this is going to show really, really red as you can see but if we put it as say for 0 0.6 that's going to be less so and then again not it goes up to you can have here 0.9. Uh, so there you go, 0.9, and there it doesn't really show up at all. 0.8 does a bit, and there 6 and 7, if you want some effect, is, is basically where, where it is. Um, and we just, what we want to do here, we're just going to preview that. So, just show sure you're in a live browser using Edge. So there you go. So if it was, for example, 0. Uh, oops, just made a mistake there. Well, 0. 0.9. If you put it in the uh, in the browser, again, you won't see much. That's just slightly transparent. So I hope you've learned something from this. Uh, it's quite easy to do. You just put in the opacity. Um, word and your semicolon or colon and then your note point wherever you want. So thanks for watching and thanks for listening.